What's going on guys, TGKS Productions. This video is a walkthrough of the Mount Gordo Junk Energy Time Trial. Junk Energy Time Trials are new daily ones that have been added as part of the San Andreas Mercenaries DLC. And in this video, I'm gonna include tips and tricks to help you beat the part time of the Mount Gordo one as quick as possible. In any case, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like and consider subscribing. Let's get right into it. Here's the location for this time trial. Keep in mind, if you don't see it on the map, that means it's not the current one in rotation. And to complete this time trial, you must beat a par time of 1 minute and 55 seconds. To start off, make sure you are pedaling as fast as you possibly can and hitting the boost as soon as it recharges. So you're going to hit the boost as soon as you're able to, just starting out, and then it should refill just before you hit this second checkpoint you're going to want to hit the boost for a second time now you, i don't recommend hitting the boost until you're around these next two checkpoints actually three checkpoints this one coming up being the third one here you're going to cut that turn very sharp and then hit the boost right out of it you're also going to want to cut this turn very sharp you're pedaling at full speed still or as fast as you can i recommend freewheeling around this turn here so letting up before you hit it which essentially is just gliding down not pedaling at all and then hitting the boost there freewheel around this turn also because if you notice there if you're going full speed and you try to go around that turn you're probably going to fly off the hill hit the boost once you have it recharged and i don't recommend hitting the boost even around these next two or a few checkpoints here once you're past this one that i just hit mainly because i've hit into that area a few times especially when using the boost so don't recommend it free will around this turn that you just saw and then take this turn very wide and once you're sort of on the straightaway here and you have both tires securely on the ground hit the boost and then pretty much from here, it's just a straight shot, or just about almost a straight shot down to the finish. So you're just wanna, gonna wanna keep hitting the boost as soon as it recharges. I will say once you get under the train track bridge here, be careful of the pillars as well as stay to the left, I recommend, of the tree that I just passed there. And from there, finish off this time trial. So I would say this time trial is definitely easier than the previous one that was added, the West of Vinewood one, but still not necessarily the easiest one, which I'd say at this point is the Mount Chiliad East one. Of course, by the time all of them are added in, that very well could change. I do recommend completing it in the daytime for better visibility. If you're a regular GT Line player, you should earn around $51 to $52,000 for completing these time trials. GTA Plus players currently earn an additional 1.5 times rewards. I will continue to upload walkthroughs of these Junk Energy time trials as they release and will include them in a playlist. I also have walkthroughs of the RC Pedito time trials as well as the House Special Work ones and have them in playlists also. So if you want to see a walkthrough on those, feel free to check them out. In any case, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it extremely beneficial. Please hit the like, subscribe, share it. As always, have a great day.